Marijuana still classified among the most dangerous drugs like meth and cocaine here in Nevada. Now the state Supreme Court is deciding if that should be changed. The Nevada ACLU is representing a group suing the Nevada Board of Pharmacy as the state agency continues to follow federal guidelines for drug classification. After arguments concluded today, Fox 5 spoke with the ACLU's legal director. Nevada's Supreme Court justices hearing arguments Tuesday afternoon on how marijuana should be classified in the state. Nevada voters legalized cannabis use for medical purposes back in 2000, and there are now dispensaries across the state, but the Nevada Board of Pharmacy has not changed its classification. While well, Nevada law allows them to consider um, what the federal government is doing, it does not obligate them to follow the federal government's scheduling. Obviously, if we had to do exactly what the federal government was doing, we would not have a cannabis industry in the state. In Nevada, marijuana remains a scheduled one controlled substance, the most severe classification for drugs that have no medical value and can't be safely distributed under medical supervision. Schedule one is the most serious. That's where you find methamphetamine and heroin. A nonprofit cannabis equity organization representing a man convicted on marijuana charges under the Schedule One status sued and is now being assisted by the ACLU. I worked as a public defender at the Clark County Public Defender's Office, and I represented a number of people, usually young people, that were being charged with criminal offenses that were based upon the board's regulation of cannabis, right, rather than keeping in mind that the way we view cannabis in the state has changed. It's meant to be treated and regulated like alcohol. More than a year ago, a district court agreed, ruling the state agency cannot classify cannabis as Schedule 1, that it violates the Nevada Constitution. But the Nevada Board of Pharmacy appealed, sending the debate to the state Supreme Court. The ACLU also argues that while the state pharmacy board regulates drugs in our state, they should no longer have authority over cannabis because the legislature gave that authority to the Cannabis Control Board. Fox 5 has been covering this ongoing legal battle for years, and we previously spoke with an attorney for the Nevada Board of Pharmacy who said that they will not comment on pending litigation.